honestly don't think that I did like it at first. I think I hated it, but it kept me away from home. So I went into the gym three hours a day. Eventually, I just liked it. And I think without training, without developing the love I did at such a young age, I don't know if I would be here still. My name is Jared Feather, and currently I am in grad school for exercise, physiology, kinesiology, whatever you want to call it. It all falls under the same umbrella. During my master's, I've been working with Renaissance Periodization as their head physique and bodybuilding consultant. Growing up, it was me, uh, my siblings, and my mom. For the most part, it was just us. There were six of us, and my mother had a rare tumor that's hereditary. Sometimes I would have to take over, resume responsibility for helping my siblings. The town in general really is like a big sort of drug town, like a lot of cocaine and meth and things of that nature. We'd have food stamps, but there were six of us. Sometimes we didn't have enough food stamps. We would all be looking forward to the first of the month because that's when we got them. And then it'd be a week of food and then it'd be uh, three weeks of hell, basically. friend said come after uh, school with me to weight training because he was the same way uh, super rough we had met in one of those housing places that we lived in together and uh, he just basically said hey come to uh, train with me after school one day so I did I started seeing more muscle built and more muscle built every week and uh, it kept me motivated to do that uh, it kept me away from home and it eventually just fell into the process and fell in love with the process so obviously <laughs> genetically I just kind of was more apt to uh, adapting to the type of training we were doing and I love to grow the most muscle possible. I love seeing how we can modify variables through science and mathematics and data and make good humans great. I actually won my pro card in natural bodybuilding last year. Um, one of the youngest professional bodybuilders in natural bodybuilding currently. The day before like my kind of year anniversary of being a pro, I ended up winning a professional bodybuilding show as well. One day I'm going to be on the Olympia stage. It's going to happen. Uh, unless I get hit by a car or <laughs> I die tomorrow, uh, I'm going to. I had, I think, 10 clients last year who turned pro, which was really cool. I love coaching. Whenever I uh, sit here and I'm answering my clients and I'm uh, making new programs for them, I don't feel like I'm working. I feel like I'm having a conversation with other intellects, and it's awesome. They ask me some of the most amazing questions uh, that anyone could, honestly. I like to talk to people between my sets. I like to uh, help other people while I'm in the gym. Uh, I get down to the nitty gritty, obviously, whenever it's all said and done. I not only get to help other people become the best, but I get to help my family. And that's the ultimate goal with all of this. I am Jared Feather, and I am the Renaissance Difference.